be ready minute one to do it. What about Bloomberg's internal email to, to, to his anti-gun groups, Wolf King, uh, saying, get ready, we're about to launch a major operation? Absolutely. I mean, this is so well planned. Two, two and a half years, millions of dollars invested. Think about it. You had to get the entire community involved, from the Catholic priest all the way down to your local uh, government agents, your uh, selectmen, your city council. These people, they're arrogant. Let me tell you, when I flew up there to Hartford, Connecticut, Newtown, they're so arrogant. I believe they all have immunity. I think they can do whatever they want. Well, they know listen, my dad's a dentist, and he was approached about four years ago by Homeland Security to go to these meetings and then spy on people. And my dad, and the guy was real, gave him a card. My dad called, checked it, and, and my dad had been treating some of his family for decades. And so he knew who the guy was, knew he was in college. This is a decade later. And this guy's with Homeland Security. And he said, yeah. And my dad said, what would I be looking for? People saying they're going to do something violent. He goes, no, just what your patients are thinking, politically doing. And we want you to influence people, basically, as an agent. And my dad thought they were setting him up because he's my dad. No, they were ignorant, didn't even know who he was, basically. My dad then talked to all the other dentists. It was happening all over the city. Under InfraGuard and these other spy programs, they tell people, you're going to be part of a drill, national security. And so, it, and so because there's an appeal of authority and we're doing this for the children, they can then canvas and get people lined up. And then once they're signed on to it, they're part of the conspiracy and have to keep quiet like the Manhattan Project or so many other programs. And so under this mantle of, 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 of local spy grids, that's how they get people to go along with the cover-up. Well, they, they really did a good job of writing the scripts and getting people hooked. And the dash cam videos on that day, Alex, these police officers, Connecticut and Newtown, they actually had lunch inside the Sandy Hook Elementary School. Alex, you can see it. Now, there are 20 dead bodies. You got adults. You got the shooter killed himself. And people are eating lunch inside the same. And they're street. ordering porta potties. Anybody that knows, you see one dead kid, you don't eat for a day. You go home, you cry, you throw up. You don't and, go have lunch by their dead, splattered bodies. And if you look at the crime scene photos, there are more urinals and toilets inside that school than I've ever imagined. I mean, I haven't seen that many. Then why order porta potties? You know, why have all the toilets? But they order porta potties, eat lunch inside the school. These people did a bad job writing the scripts. You don't screw with public schools unless you know how we operate. Uh, again, you've run major universities. You've advised hundreds of public schools. I mean, I looked you up when you started going public the last year. You were in the top two or three groups consulting nationwide. I mean, you, you were making a lot of money. You have no reason to be doing this, to be going public. I mean, I would imagine you've lost a lot of business. And you tell that to my wife. I am about to kick out of my own house after being married 39 years. Alex, I'm about to lose my family because I'm simply asking the questions that you and your stations are looking at. And I'm asking you right now, and I'm asking all your listeners, doggone it, support InfoWars. Become part of the Warriors. We need out. We need this show. We need the truth. Uh, if you find it in your heart to donate a few dollars to our legal funds, let me tell you, we have them. We have the lawsuits filed. We are closed, but we can't do it without people helping me. I'm too old for this, but I do need help. But big thing is support InfoWars, because if we don't have your voice, nobody's going to hear the truth. Well, folks need to donate, and, and briefly, because we're going to break, tell us the specifics of where it was filed, what's going on with the lawsuit. Well, it's filed here in Seminole County because all of my businesses, Children's Safety Institute, the National Institute, this is my home, this is where I live. And so instead of going to Connecticut where everything is crooked, we're gonna come in the back door and therefore we filed it, it's in the Seminole County court system. The judge, I mean the female judge, she saw what we're talking about and she did not hesitate issuing those 10 subpoenas across the country. And they've been served, and we're not just waiting for all of the responses. Wow. Well, this is big national news. I want to jam in a phone call right now before we go to break. John in California, you're on the air. Thanks for calling. Hi. Uh, yeah, this is John from Paradise, California. Um, I was just wondering for you, Wolfgang, what uh, group or specific 
whether it's an individual or a government agency, police department, has been digging in their heels most and giving you the most resistance. Um, and also, all due respect to, if anything, anyone did lose their life in the Sandy Hook tragedy. Uh, well, okay. You know, I agree with you, and I say this to you. I, I'm begging that I'm wrong. And if they answer my question to my satisfaction and to Alex's satisfaction, if they answer it to the people of America to their satisfaction, I will run to the nearest mental health facility. And I've said it before, I'll voluntarily enroll myself because if I dare uh, upset these parents or children or school, dear, I need mental health. But I tell you what, I have spent my life doing this. And when people refuse to answer simple, logical questions, it raises the red flag. And I'm telling you, I'm not gonna stop until we get the answers. We know it stinks. I mean, it's phony. The question is, what is going on? We, we don't know. We just know it's fake. How fake? We don't know. It's sick. Thank you, John. Um, Kyle, Jay, Jimmy, Eric, your calls are straight ahead. This hour brought to you by InfidelBodyArmor.com. When it hits the fan, don't be left without the body armor that will save your life. With prices starting at just $374.99 and ships free. Get yours at InfidelBodyArmor.com. Just won't quit. Hi, Ted Anderson with Midas Resources. Is it time to convert paper 401ks and IRAs to solid gold and silver yet? Get our 10 Reasons book free. Call 800-686-2237. That's 800-686-2237. By now, you heard about Bitcoins. But did you know that over 65,000 businesses accept Bitcoins? Listen, if you're already earning Bitcoins or trying to make money in the Bitcoin market, you've got to know BidBit.co. Because at BidBit.co, you can receive Bitcoin by selling your personal items or business products. You heard right. Whether personal or business, you can now buy, sell, and auction your products quickly, easily, and securely at BidBit.co. That's B-I-D. B-I-T dot C-O. BidBit.co. Attention now. Alex Jones listeners, when you're on the road or have limited data or Wi-Fi, now you can listen to Alex Jones unfiltered and untapped at no extra charge on this non-federal phone number, 1-605-562-5136. Try it now to listen to Alex Jones 24-7 at no extra cost or data charges. These are not on federal lines. These are lines located on Indian reservations off the grid. Call 1-605-562-5136. No smartphones or internet needed. To hear Alex Jones untapped and off the grid, just call 1-605-562-5136. Hey, sorry. I'm running late. I had to stop and get my vitamins for the month. I got mine in the mail yesterday from DiscountNutritionShop.com. So I'm here, totally on time. <laughs> DiscountNutritionShop.com? Yep, they're a lifesaver in more ways than one. They have all the nutritional supplements you need, the major brands you know, plus you can save up to 10%. Write down this number, 888-908-4548. Huh? 888-908-4548. Or just go to DiscountNutritionShop.com. Alex Jones here. For the last two years, I've been working with top doctors, nutritionists, and chemists to design a nutraceutical formulation that has truly life-changing health benefits. So many other formulations out there contain toxic ingredients, synthetic additives, and even GMOs. Introducing the all-new Ancient Defense Herbal Immunity Blend, crafted with over 14 key ancient herbs and extracts to supercharge and prepare your body for what experts admit is the most dangerous season of the year. We have rejected hundreds of other formulations in our quest to bring you what is simply the most powerful and comprehensive proprietary formula that we have ever created in the realm of herbal immunity. Experience the benefits of combining over 14 ancient herbs and extracts with exciting new advances in nutraceutical science. For a limited time, get 25% off on this introductory offer. Visit InfoWarsLife.com or call 1-888-253-3139. That's InfoWarsLife.com. I'm Alex Jones, your host, Wolfgang Halbig, school expert, is our guest investigating with great personal sacrifice the Sandy Hook mystery. And believe me, it is a mystery. It doesn't add up. I wish it added up. I wish it would never have happened, but it's a lot less scary to have a lone crazy on Prozac type drugs out there than it is to have it be a premeditated government operation. Kyle, Jay, Jimmy, Eric, Rick, we're going to go a little bit into the next hour with our guests to take your calls, and I'm going to shift gears into other open phones and a ton of news we haven't hit yet. 
Uh, but let's go to Kyle in Connecticut. Speaking of the site of this this sad tragedy, it's a tragedy any way you look at it. Kyle, thank you. Hi, Alex. Yeah, really good to be on the air with you. Um, I actually run a demolition company here in Connecticut. I'm about an hour and a half away from the Newtown site. Um, someone approached me months ago about the uh, the demolition of the suspected shooter's house in Newtown. This is before it actually went to public vote, and this is way before this even happened. So I was just wondering, like, between you and Wolfgang, what extent these people will go to to cover this up to make it look like that nothing ever Yeah, happened. why are they demolishing everything? Why are they passing laws to seal all the records? Um, what's going on here, Wolfgang? Well, again, uh, I'm glad, Kyle, you asked that question. I mean, think about the Sandy Hook Elementary School. It has to, you have to have a complete environmental study before you can demolish an elementary school. These people just violated every law, every regulation, and just like the house. You know, the house belongs actually supposedly to the brother of Adam Lanza if he really exists. I mean, there are so much misinformation, misdirection, and these people do whatever they want. And you know what they're saying to you and me? Well, you're stupid, America. You're too, too lazy to really investigate. And again, I go back to you. Thank you for calling. I'm thanking out. Let me tell you what. People need to wake up. Sandy Hook is an American game changer. When we solve Sandy Hook, it's going to expose Boston bombing. It's going to expose 9-11. It's going to go down to JFK. This government is running amok. They are using us and using our emotions, and guess what? They're using the national news media, NBC, CBS. CNN. Sure, let me add this. In Operation Northwoods, it wasn't just fly planes into things and blame it on Cuba, and Kennedy said no to it. They were planning to do fake shootings and real shootings in public okay. places as well. So we know this has been on the board before. So we'd be crazy not to ask the question. Uh, thank you, Kyle. Jay in Pennsylvania, you're on the air with Wolfgang Halbig. Uh, hey, I haven't really heard anything touch on it because there are like so many other perfectly good anomalies in Sandy Hook to talk about. Sure, can, I, remember, uh, like, can you guys boost the caller to me? Because everything else is loud, but uh, can can the network boost the caller to me a little bit? Thank you. Go uh, ahead, caller. I, I just took off. I went off speakers. It's better. Yeah, just talk right your telephone. Go ahead. All right, awesome. I was just wondering. I haven't heard anything touch on it just because there are so many other anomalies. But does anyone remember the um, the bus driver who said he like picked them up on the side of the road? And claimed you brought them into his house for like 30 minutes and like just letting the, the cops didn't show up for like another hour. Like the, some students some, somehow ran out of the building and some bus well, drivers. just all, yes, I've seen that interview, all sorts of bizarreness. Uh, what are some of the other bizarre anomalies or that particular one, Wolfgang? Oh, you got Gene Rosen, you've got the bus driver, you've got, can you imagine highly trained Connecticut SWAT team members can't find a nurse and a secretary inside that school? for over four hours, Alex. This Connecticut State Police ought to be ashamed of himself if that's the best that they can do. Well, that's ridiculous. A SWAT team in a school that size would find people in about 15 minutes. And the other thing, Alex, is that picture the hole. Supposedly, Adam Lanza shot out a hole through the glass window. Alex, picture 18 highly trained Connecticut State Troopers all climbing through that shot out glass window, one behind another. The three stooges are smarter than that. They would have sent Curly inside to open the door for the other two. We'll be right back, ladies and gentlemen. Stay with Thank us. More calls straight ahead. GCN. Jimmy, Eric, Rick, and others. Visit Wolfgang Helbig's our guest. Today. In the near future. When you realize how fake it all is, the football, the basketball. Mm -hmm. Security alert. This is Homeland Security. Analysis. InfoWars building independent media operations. We let the worst people get controlled and tell us that we are the ones responsible. Prime Directive discredit Alex Jones. Jones is the wildly popular conspiracy theorist. A popular conspiracy theory talk show called InfoWars. Alex Jones is now in an Austin jail. These people are assaulting us. Targeting of patriots engaged. They are never going to stop. They're never going to deviate from their program until we stop them. Block free iPhone app at InfoWars.com. Block free podcast and video feed. Imperative. Destroy Prison Planet TV. you got to set your eye on the enemy, not worry about...
public propaganda they put out intellectually. It's because you can feel it.